Hi, I'm Doug Pat, and this is 50 Ways to Design Like an Architect. Short videos with tips about how the architect does their job. This is part eight, beauty. Many years ago, I pointed out to my wife an old abandoned train trestle that crossed a river. I said, isn't that beautiful? She said, no. Now we can all agree that some things are easy to call beautiful, like a sunset. We can also agree that a thing or person can have inward beauty, outward beauty, or both. The train trestle was old and abandoned. Its condition was deteriorating. It was rusty and overgrown with weeds. But there was also something about its essence that made it much more than an obsolete overpass. The trestle had probably served for decades as a way to transport thousands and thousands of lives and many tons of cargo over a river. It had been meticulously designed, detailed, and constructed. Many lives had come and gone during its tenure on that river. It was a thing of beauty for human beings that counted on it for transportation, necessities, employment, and income. Our lives and the things of this world are the sum of what's seen and what's unseen from structural systems and details to the essence of an object or place. Architects are trained to see more than what meets the eye. We'll see you next time.